the Weekly Fix. As always, I'm Neil. Big, big news in Milan. Eichma Show is going off. We got new models, we got concepts we want to share. Some pretty serious recall information going on. And something to talk about. MXGP is making some changes. All right, so on the recall front here, some pretty big ones. KTM Husqvarna. Please make sure if you have a 2017 closed course bike, check in. There's five models from KTM and there's three from Husky. I don't have all the details, but the information is there and hopefully we'll have a link here or over here or somewhere you can check that out. All right, and the other big manufacturing recall going on is with Polaris. And sadly, once again, this is fuel related. Uh, this is for the Slingshot. So if you're a Slingshot owner, model year 2015 to 2017, manufacture date March of 2014 to October of 2016, that thing needs to come in, get to your local Polaris dealer. Looks like there's a little bit of issue on the fuel line and the hood clearance. So once again, Polaris is at it, uh, trying to take care of what's going on. So get that done and hopefully it's not your car. All right, so all week long now, uh, Eichmann has been going off in Milan. And if you don't know what that is, and I think if you're watching this, you probably do, but it's the motorcycle show. So some of the new releases, and there are way too many to talk about, but a few that stick out to us that we like and we know are gonna work here. Honda, they're doing a rally version of the CRF 250L. So it's gonna have the shrouds on it, it's gonna have some LED lights. The key to this motorcycle though, and making a rally version is 2.6 gallon tank. Now you're talking about 200 miles, so man, you can go some distance on this thing. Another one that's gonna sell, and people have already been doing this anyways, on the current platform of the Street Twin Triumph, is they're making an actual factory scrambler. So high pipes, knobby tires, fenders, the usual fun stuff. And honestly, that kind of bike, I would have loved to make that anyways, but now they're doing it for me. But make sure you check it out because there are a ton of new bikes coming out and they look awesome. All right, on the other end of EICMA, as always, it's probably our favorite part of the entire show are the concepts. So a few I want to talk about. Yamaha, they're doing a T7. Make sure you look this thing up. It's based on the FCO7 platform. So a parallel twin, solid bike, easy power band throughout the whole motor, but off-road ready. The thing looks badass. Kind of a, another shout out to one of my favorite cheesy sci-fi movies, Megaforce, which we should be adding a clip to that motorcycle right now. Chris is laughing. Uh, KTM, 790 Duke concept, one word, badass. They better make this. Make sure you write your local KTM representative. Tell them to please make this bike because the pictures right now on the naked street look sick. Uh, Honda, CB 1100 TR. Uh, another one word definition for this, steezy. Uh, turn the exhaust, the thing looks badass. Big old brakes on it. So that Honda is interesting though because as they always do, you know, will it be made? We don't know chime in because who knows, but I'd love to see this thing. So make sure you check out some of the concept bikes, but those are some of our favorites there. All right, here's my man Vince with a very special announcement. And here's the clip of the week. <laughs> <laughs> Quick uh, glamorous story. Obviously, want to say thanks to everybody we saw on uh, Halloween weekend. Tons of fun, super hot, sandy as always. Uh, Matt and myself were lucky enough to get some four seat turbo razors. Had a great time, especially in a line, having fun, duning, big dunes, little dunes. But uh, he got a little bit of the sandbox action, and to better tell the story from his point of view, because I was in the car behind, okay. enjoying it. Uh, he can tell you all about eating sand. Oh, yeah. Well, anyways, uh, yeah, we were uh, you know in the dunes, you know, following the boss man, and all of a sudden. Who's get ruthless, by the way. Yeah, so <laughs> get, uh, you know, blast sand blasted by boss man, and, you know, honestly, you know, having a, already having a concussion really didn't work out that great. <laughs> oh, that's right. He's been injured, so he's also been our one-hand bandit where he had a, a cast for a little while. He's also knocked himself out uh, riding a mountain bike, and then we buried him in sand, literally, in a car, so. Yeah, all in the uh, two-month span? Yes. Right? Yeah, yeah right. two, months. two months. It was a good time. It was a good time. But anyways, we had a great weekend, so again, thanks everyone for stopping by the booth, seeing you out in the dunes. It was a good time, and uh, we'll see you next week.